Daniel Krause discusses today's jobs with his colleague Rena. He runs the classic tattoo Krause shop. These are the tools of his trade, inks and chemicals which have been in use for many years, but no longer. We get new colors, but in the moment we have around about 100, 120 different colors. The new colors, when the colors coming in the middle of the year, we have just 30 colors. This is the thing. And we lose from the quality 30%. It's precisely these colors which Daniel believes are the lifeblood of his craft. Um, colors are the important thing for a tattoo artist. This is, um, this is the, what tattooing is. Bring colors in the skin, under the skin. The people come, I like to have this thing. I'm sorry, I don't have colors. Yeah, what you can do? Take just work, play with the needles or whatever? This is, this, is, this is the base to work. When you take the base, you destroy the business. But to others, such inks are dangerous. The EU says they pose a serious health hazard. That these substances are actually also restricted in cosmetics. So you're not allowed to use them in cosmetics, which are just placed on the skin. Uh, and now we are extending that, of course, to um, these uh, materials which were injected under the skins. Some estimates suggest around 12% of people across the EU have at least one tattoo. Here in Germany, that number is believed to be even higher, perhaps around 20%. So what takes place in the body when these now banned inks come into contact with it? Here at the German Federal Risk Assessment Institute, Dr. Michael Gyurbudagyan told me one concern is what happens beneath the skin barrier. We know that not all pigments remain on the place where the tattoo is uh, being made or in, uh, the tattoo pigment is injected. We know that from studies that the lymph nodes of tattooed individuals are colored. Whatever the rights or wrongs of this particular issue, tattoos themselves remain very popular, especially for young people like Cassiel back at the Krauser tattoo shop. He's having a favorite cartoon character inked onto his arm. For the moment, Snoopy will be there in just black and white. But Cassiel says he's got plans for more colorful tattoos someday soon. Dominic Kane, Al Jazeera, Berlin.